No, no, nothing on YouTube. What are you doing, Dee? Telling me to go. Oh. Everybody ready? Ready. All right. Ding. All right. So guys, first part, first half of the class, we worked on doing whip patterns, yes? First what we did was we did a real neat pattern where we get the woman into closed position. From there, she slides out. Gentlemen, bring the arm in so that she does an outside turn. From here, we did an outside free spin for the leg. Yes, I'll do it from the other side so you get to see it from both sides. We did a whip. The lady slides in the open. Bring her in for an outside turn. And a free spin following on the other side. Yes, from here, we also did what I call the backwards whip. Biggest thing you guys need to think about one, two, three, and four. The halt at the other end happens earlier. Guys need to make sure they get across the slot on the three and four. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. Last one we did is we did a whip with an inside turn following with a guy going down the slot with the lady. Seven and eight into a tuck turn with the advanced football. Let me do it from the other side so you can see it both ways. This is the other side. Okay. One, two, three, and four. Inside turn. Guy going down the slot with the lady into the tuck. Two, three, and four, five, and six. Those were the whips that we did in the class. Then we worked, worked turned and did more bending and scrolling patterns. The first ones we did, we did both as a six count and an eight count pattern. We did a turning basic, wait, that's not what I want to say. This is why I don't want it on YouTube. <laughs> we did, gentlemen, you're going to bring the lady in to close position on the eight count pattern. You're going to turn five, six, coming around seven, and eight. If we do the six count pattern, gentlemen, you want to get a head start if you can. One, two, three, and four. And then we have five and six. To turn around, we want to be connected so that we can start right again on that next pattern. Doing those two again. Two, three, and four. Five, six, seven, and eight. Or one, two, three, and four. Five, and six. We then did a tuck in front for the gentlemen, or for the ladies. One, two, Tuck the ladies, gentlemen come around on five and six. Again, we're connected and ready to go to the next pattern. And then the last one we did, we did from handshake position. One, two, three, catching the lady's shoulder on four. We did walk back five, six, seven, and eight. We also did this as a six count pattern, that's the last one we did. One, two, three, and four. Five and six. The difference between the six and the eight, gentlemen use the hand on the shoulder more to spin the lady around, being able to back up on five and six, ready to go. <laughs> Thank you very much.